morning. It is Monday. It's Monday. Two days post show. This is the physique. There was no post show binge or anything, but uh, total of the calories for the day of the show was about 5,000. 5, Yesterday was between the food and the alcohol last night. It was um, about 5, just under 5,000 as well, I'd say. And yeah, we're not looking too bad, but I'm going back to macros, <laughs> normal macros today. Well, that's the plan anyways, I have good intentions. 60 fat, 325 carb, and 185 proteins. A lot of people can get stuck in the trap of the show's over, big goal they were working towards, and now that's it. They have nothing else to work towards, and they just can't help themselves. Hormones are all over the place, so you're constantly hung you're constantly hung like you're not hungry, but you have just such an appetite. You can keep eating and eating. Uh, me and Keen found that with meals we were eating over the weekend, like really big meals, taking them down quickly, but just not satisfied. But you have to like you have to try and stop yourself. Otherwise, you fuck yourself up. So yeah, it's Monday, it's shied out. It's grim, or bleak, as Potter Welsh would say. It's not great. So, yeah, went out last night. First alcoholic beverage in 20 weeks. 20 weeks, yeah, because I did drink at the, st <laughs> I did drink at the early stages of this prep on a night out we had in Dublin so yeah, it was 20 weeks I only had like four four or five drinks last night so I feel fine today um, yeah last night was shy enough what a waste of fucking calories wasting calories and alcohol it's fucking shy anyways I'm gonna go weigh myself now or I'll stand here talking shit all fucking day. But what are we going to weigh? I'd say 75.3. That's fairly fucking precise. Oh shit. 76.4. 76.4. But. I have to do that again. I have to do that consistently every day. That's, that's going to drop you now. Well, it should drop when I get my normal water intake um, back, about well, three liters, and I get my foods back in check, tracking my macros. That'll come down to like 75 ish. Should sure, anyway. That's if I behave myself. <sighs> Yeah, I'm not gonna stress over that. What I will stress over is this fucking shit turn. Back. Stay in it. Alright, Monk is upstairs. He was out last night with me as well. I'm gonna go make him coffee. He's just getting dressed. Boy, Monk. Walking around my house in the fucking nip. Here, let's get you in a bit of big tea's lighting. Yeah, my friend. So what you're telling me is you don't need to track macros. <laughs> what the fuck? 
You can keep eating shite. That's after four and a half, just a little bit over the bowl once last night, so I'll hit for dinner. I forgot about that. Why don't you eat? Let's go get our coffee. I'm gonna go for a walk. Why are you gonna go for a walk? Those steps up. It's book two of them. Yeah, you're right, it is. The weekend, professional. What a tune! Why are you crying? Is this not what you love? Do you not love this shit? Sorry, I'm not talking to the camera. If you all could smell what the monk is cooking. I'm not talking to you. Oh, you're pulling. <laughs> Yeah, see if I can get this. <laughs> <laughs> How was that? Yeah, it didn't look nice. It didn't look good. You go how many did you get? Eight. Watch you in your first one? So make sure it's not it's no it's no more than 25 seconds. Cause like if you do the right time in here, the drop off, you should be down a bit more with your drop off like. Smiling on him. <laughs> Whatever it takes. <laughs> Let's go. You getting the taste of the Olympia yet? Three weeks out. Yeah, I'm gonna start cycling tomorrow. Let's get a new bike. No, Trent. Uh -huh. You called your bike friend? Yeah. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five.
How was that, Big G? Zoom in. They up close to person. They need to know me as a person. They don't feel personal if you're that far. Not come closer, so zoom in. Broly Winkler drop. Let's go, Big G! What's next? Megan B. Guys, you can thank uh, Mind and Keen's person to our coach, um, Kevin Walsh. That's the coach. Selling there. online 12 week shred pants, 24 weeks back. Where can they find you? On all social media platforms. Twitter, you'll see, you'll see him standing uh, with his supplements LinkedIn, in front, in front of his punto. Trade <laughs> sponsored athlete. <sighs> ah, come on. When you busting up, but she keeps sucking. I'd say go back a little bit. Good. Get the gooch out. Yeah, coach. Do a quarter turn there, Bren. Like this job? Yeah. No, like a quarter turn, like a men's physique job. Bren, I think you look better now than the last day. Do you? Yeah, I honestly do. Definitely your back. Your front looked fine the last day. Your back looks sick. Your back looks fucking different gravy to the last day, man. It just looks better, man. Yeah, just looks yeah. better. Remember what I said to you before, Brennan? Pizza's night four, more water, would you have fared out more, better? 999, 1,000, 3,000, 2,076, keep going. So this first session, done, dusted, after Post prep, first session post prep. Something went off. <sighs> Feels good, man. Right, it's Monday and I'm just after doing my grocery shop. Bought pretty much the same things I've been buying when I was on prep like spices, sauces, uh, eggs. These berries, I fucking love berries. Blueberries there as well. Blackberries, it's not focused, but you know what, blackberries. And raspberries look like. I'd buy shit tons more of those there if they were cheaper. All my veg still, uh, low calorie wraps, bit of yogurt, seasoning, pepper, apple, dates. These are actually something I tried while I was on prep and um, I really like them with jewel dates. Not everyone does. I quite like them. And those white chocolate. White chocolate combo with that dark chocolate in the oats is unreal. In here then, we've got our monster meats, turkey burgers, lean beef mints, chicken, chicken. So yeah, very vulnerable competitors are after a show to eating a fucking shitload of shite right after. But we're not binging, not this time. The cheeks are staying down. Monk, I feel so bad. You forgot your mints. Extra mints and green beans. People, I can't explain through a camera 
how good the monk cooks his mints and his green beans. It's, I'd say, for, to me, anyways, this shit is like heroin to a heroin addict. This is that good. You wouldn't think it, it just is. The smell that's coming out of this lunchbox and the lunch, the monk forgot this. Oh, he's gonna be sickened. Keen, thank you so much. I'm gonna enjoy that, mate. <laughs> what's up, what's up? It's Wednesday. Pretty much my day off from training, usually, and work. So I've done pretty much fucking nothing all day. I've sat in my arse and just letting you know, it's a terrible feeling. You feel absolutely shit doing nothing all day. So when I do do it, do do, do do, I feel bad. Even though I shouldn't because I'm on my feet fucking pretty much 24-7 training, working, whatever. But I still feel bad when I do it. So, last minute decision. Not a home workout, not a gym workout, a farm workout. That's right taking you down to my farm. This is where the gains begin. And we're fucking training the muscle that looks pretty impressive in this camera right now. Arms. Look at the size of that arm. Boom, we're training arms. I'm taking the little bro with me. So we're gonna get some pre-workout now. Half can of monster, cause it's a bit late in the evening. I don't like fucking taking in caffeine too late in the evening. And I'm gonna have some fruit. Save all the calories for tonight. Gonna to make a mad August a koi bowl. Big bowl. Greek yogurt basically. So yeah, let's go. Orange, white or yellow? Either are. I'll go yellow. And Pack of these. Combo. No. There you go, Kant. Go ahead. Yellow monster. First time trying. Tastes like linseed. All right, we're going. We're going. We're running. Farm is. It's down there. Let's go. Woo. Come on then. Dickhead. Yeah, film me. Oh, Lord. The camera loves me. Don't drop it. Just really on your walking. Yeah. Well, Cody, oh. you're just walking like. Oh. Yeah, Tor, Tor. It's a famous river, I haven't. Hey, Eddie! Hey! Eddie! Shit, that ain't Eddie. Walking berries? What's this going to be called? Shy talks and walks. How to get farmer arms. No. Alright, I'm good. No. Yeah. <laughs> Alright. It's the other one. Hard. That required a lot of thinking. What? Arnold and Franco, this is their old gym. And here it is. Well, the home farm gym. We're about to get the sickest of pumps here. Oh, lighting though. Big K. <laughs> <laughs> He's actually going to feed the cows before we start. 
I'm going to devise up, I'm going to create the program for a little arm workout. It's recording now. Yeah. Before we start, we got to feed the cats. Make the noise. Mating call. Huh? Nothing. No. They're coming. Good job, boy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, fuck, they're, they're fast, them. man. Yeah, they're dead. With that brown or white one. No thing. Hey boys, that's honestly like me when I'm making a bowl of oats. You get fucking stuck in. Alright, oh, it's time to go fucking train now. Huh? Let's get it. Try it. twist straight away, come up, but catch it. So don't come up all the way, if you come up all the way, you lose attention. So come up to about there. You know exactly where you let it, where you catch it, where it feels best, and let it pull. And once you reach there, then you can let it twist. If you let it, if you go up, if you go up and you twist right away in the, on the way down, you just it's just gonna go to your forearm. You're not gonna feel it in your bicep at all. So up, just catch it, let it pull, twist. Obviously, I'm going for high reps because this is light. Alright, little bro's going now. We're gonna superset this with close grip push ups. <laughs> what? Fucking pump. I know. Fan pump. Muscle fan. Now 30 seconds, get the heart rate back down. Then down for close grip push ups. I'm not counting, we just go for it. But form. Is important to keep on the tricep. That look good there, is it? Did. Hey. The point is, is keep the arms under the shoulders, elbows tucked, and keep the load your body weight on the arms. Alright, so the second of fatigue, just bang them out. Oh, man. Yeah. <sighs> Ah, oh, oh. Shit! That was so fucking pump. Your turn. Look at that form. <laughs> 15 years old. For a long man. Champ. Yes, bro. Arm pump is no joke. We're going barbell curls with dumbbell skull crushes. We're just going to do them lying down on the floor. Uh. Oh fuck, Jesus they were tough, I didn't think they'd be that tough. Usually you do those on a bench. Obviously it's not ideal to do it on that bench. So the floor is good, just lift your head up a bit, keep your elbows pulling together. And kind of stretch, let your arms stretch back. And then explosive up again, constantly keeping your elbows. The two magnets pulling together. Alright man. So bring more, bring your arms back more this way. Yeah. Go on. Oh. Well on. Good man, you feeling all the triceps? Yeah. Sweet, good work, brother. <laughs> I'm at the end of the reps now. Fucking hell. Oh, fuck. Push cut. I can
Time, so the last exercise is going to do hammer curls to dumbbells to failure. But while I'm doing that, Kyle's going to do the like almost like tricep extension. So you're trying to bend your tricep, your arm back the way it doesn't bend. So I'm really trying to bend this arm back that way. Obviously, you can't, but it creates that much more of a squeeze. So we went had like 40, 50 minutes set of training. Literally did like three, like two, two fucking supersets of bicep tricep exercise. Then at the end then did like a set failure of uh, the hammer curls and those body weight tricep extensions. What a deadly workout, wasn't it? Yeah. Actually was serious. It's training sessions like this is so sound and cringe like like back when I was really young when I started uh, it's what made me like fall in love fall in love with training just going in because because I've been following a program now for the last 24 weeks hasn't changed much it's nice to just go down and train arms do a complete bro session on the spot and just get all the fucking blood in there get all the blood rushing it just feels unreal so yeah basically i fell in love with training there again tonight on my rest day uh, and never give me an excuse about equipment because as you saw we literally just used a barbell and two dumbbells with the little weight we had we made it work if your technique and form and everything is good it's going to be painful and you're gonna feel it. Let me point that at you for a sec. You're used to training down there, but I'm not. How was that training session compared to the ones you have? Sore. Sore? Yeah. Is it better or worse? It's good, like, good uh, uh, be down there at some place. So you're always going on your own. It was different for a change, it was cool enough. Yeah, it's nice to have a training partner every now and then. It is. Yeah, definitely. All right, so there it is, the shot in the sea, farm, arm workout. Arm farm, farm, muscle farm, arm workout. To get all the fucking gains. And then you go, and then you have to go into a field, and then to get your protein, you have to go and kill a cow and eat it raw. Pretty big fucking ball, wouldn't you agree? It's gonna make something epic. We've got frozen fruit, frozen yogurt, brownies, stevia, granola, chocolate chips, blueberries, strawberries, Greek yogurt, banana. Well, let's get cracking on it. Hello! Oh. There's two minutes left in recording. Enough for this, anyways. Why are you looking at me like that for? It's recording, Yanni. Yeah, yeah, why won't you look down there? <laughs> <laughs> you are a dumbass man. Oh yeah, you're all nice, you know, for camera. Do I look like being nice? <laughs> Not being nice. Alright, that looks like a lot. It's about... It's about like 20 on these. Yeah, it's dark, isn't it? Yeah, isn't it? That's better. Alright, so 200 grams of frozen fruit just went in there. Put some frozen yogurt in. Zero this bitch. Bit of frozen yogi. Not sure how this is gonna taste. Yogi yogi job. Put a bit more. So your breathing's pure loud again. Yeah. I'm after training, man. I'm tired. You, you caught yourself there? No, you heard it. <sighs> Wrecked. Oh, sweet. That's nice. 
What was it called? Yeah, almond milk. Stevia. Yeah, just the stevia, no, and the milk. Yeah. What's that? Stevia. Sweetener. What's the sweetener? Sweetener. <laughs> and a bit of milk. And then this is our base for our bowl. This is our base for a bowl. After that sick farm workout. This is what farmers eat. <laughs> Three seconds, shit. Okay, go, ten minutes. Yeah. Milk's after gone in, Stevie's after going in. Let's blend this bitch. Alright, so that's what we got. I've never, we've never done this before. I don't even know what to call this, but that's what we're going for today, anyways. So we'll layer this in now. This goes in the bowl, yup. So I'll bring this over here. <laughs> Do I have to record this, yeah? Did you record some of it? I, I record the whole thing, you just scraping in. Alright, leave it. So next, we're putting on the Greek yogurt. I've never actually tasted this Greek yogurt. Ooh, what the fuck? Oh, jeez, I was thinking. Yeah, it's plastic. Plastic. It's like, what is this? Ah, man. It's fine. Looks my own. So I thought that would taste right, it's actually not too bad. It's bland, but not bad. What's bland? Mystery. What? In this thing. Fuck. What's bland? Bland. What's bland? Bland. Like, tasteless. Like, oh. um... What you say tasteless? <laughs> oh, sorry. <laughs> it's a lot of Greek yogurt, isn't it? It's nearly the fucking half the kilo going in. That's look like Matty Ovis as well. Truth. Shout out to Matt August as well, actually. He's the fucker who. He had like the. He had, like smoothed it out. Yeah, well, it'll go for 600 grams. <coughs> you can't focus on this camera. Focus it and then you have to stop recording. Focus it and then stop recording. Can't be arrested. Well, if it's not focused, it's not really going to look good, is it? Right. Okay, looks that, like looks it, looks like that looks pretty impressive. That looks pretty impressive. Oh, that looks good. Looks good. We'll go That's off. the job. We'll go with some granola. Throw it all in. Throw it all in. Throw it all in. That's deadly, man. Why is that serious in the morning? Alright, next. Looks like a pink bowl cereal, but the milk is feel like it's gone off and it's just not liquidy. Next we'll go with blueberries. How much you know, recording time is that from that? Uh, 6 minutes 45 seconds. Sweet. Um, well, 95 grams of blueberries. All oh, the fucking blueberries. You're getting half this as well, like. You're, you won't pay for any of this shit. This is my shit. My I shit. introduce you to my friend, Jim. It's looking good so far, isn't it? We'll go. <coughs> three, three, three brownies? Some focus. Do you remember all the figures for everything? Figures? What do you mean? So all that worked. I'm tracking this after. Do you remember every number used? What are you on about? What? For the numbers, weight, like, do you remember the weight of everything? Like. Like, oh, like 600 grams of frozen yogurt and all that. Yeah. Why do I need to remember that? It's on the, I'd say it's on the video. Oh, I don't even think I was looking at the bowl there. Alright. Chocolate chips. Oh, yeah. Okay, then strawberries. This looks fucking epic. Alright, so seconds, we off. sliced the strawberries and now. Five, We're slicing four, the banana. Three, two, one. Didn't get it. This is looking pretty fucking epic. Don't 
Don't curse on camera. Look we'll make you, YouTube look money. YouTube. You won't make YouTube money now. It's all the grade I'm making. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, that banana's 95 grams. Uh, is that the last one? Dark chocolates. Oh, sorry. This is my dark chocolate too, not yours. I wasn't saying it, no. You can't wait. It's nice how you can tell. It's Difference. Good with this one. Yeah. I can't even see that. It's pretty dark chocolate, isn't it? Looks dark, isn't it? It's fairly dark chocolate, <laughs> and it's called dark chocolate. It was a joke, oh my god. It was uh, like your man, not about me. What? <laughs> your man said it was a joke. How about you? Yeah. That, it's done now. That looks fucking ridiculous. Bring it open to the light. Yeah, yeah. <coughs> oh, oh, oh my god. Look what? at my head. Like, it's bigger than my head. <laughs> Hello? Hold on the Irish Independent there, kid. Damn, that looks ridiculous. Oh my god. What are you at, man? If that goes on the glass head, man, go legs. It's the only reason why that wouldn't go on the glass head. Well, you've left it down the glass head. It's a little for the picture. It's don't... just a newspaper. Why is this in the room? It's on. Holy shit balls. For the grand. Because I'm the basic white bitch. The zoom in and out is deadly. Yeah. He's been doing it the whole video. Holy shit balls. <laughs> Wait. Let's go, baby. <laughs> Look for your scroll if you have shrimp. Holy shit balls. Let's go with it. Woman, I wanna eat this, it looks deadly. Um We'll try it now. Off for the camera and then we'll clean up. I think we should clean up this. It's not gonna like it's not gonna it's not like it's going anywhere. It is. Some Let's see. Video oh come eat. on, just eat it man. I'm waiting for you. It's a big enough bite anyway. Mm. How is it? Ah oh, it is me. Is it? Trying to get everything at once. Yeah, same. Alright. Jesus Christ, that's good, isn't it? It's got so much flavour. All right, goodness. So, with my fitness pad out here, I tracked everything. This bowl is coming to a total of 2,356 calories, 269 carbs, 98 fat, and 90 protein. Um, but me and my little brother are are having it so it's coming to about 1200 calories each so yeah that was really quick and simple for anyone who struggles to gain weight <laughs> there's a nice little dessert for you so yeah I'm gonna tuck into this now oh it's sweet isn't it I'm really happy with how this turned out boom So that's the video. Peace.